YouTube channel. My name is Danica and I'm the Fit Mom Lifestyle on Instagram, LTK, and TikTok. And today I have another Lululemon haul for you. So I hope that you are enjoying Vlogmas in July. It's been so fun to come out with a video every other day. So if you haven't seen some of my most recent videos, make sure you check out my YouTube channel. Um, I've got lots of Lululemon hauls lots of Nordstrom um, anniversary sale content, so make sure that you are subscribed and checking out all my videos because there's a lot of good stuff coming out. So, today we're gonna be going through a few items that I recently picked up from Lululemon, and it's just so funny because I'm wearing like all black and I'm all cozy because the air has been blasting in our house, but it's like 100 degrees outside, so I'm like, I look like I'm ready for fall, not summer, but it is July, um, it's just cold in the house. So. Um, I am wearing my black um, oversized full zip. So I'll link this for you as well in case you're wondering. So anyway, I will stop talking and let's get into the product. All right, so if you enjoy Lululemon videos, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and click the notification bell so you're notified every time I make a new video and give this video a thumbs up so I know you're enjoying it. And the first item that I wanna start out with is a workwear item that I wear all the time. So if you've seen my Instagram stories, my TikTok, or honestly any of my hauls, um, you would know that I love the stretch high rise pant and jogger, whichever version, any like anything, all of it. Um, so basically I currently have the black jogger in a size eight in the full length version. And I sized up to an eight because I didn't want it too tight on my butt. My normal size is a six. And I also got the full length because I just wasn't sure what length to get. I've got the stretch high rise regular pants in the seven eighths. So I just wanted to try the full length. Anyway, I decided to grab the size six in the seven eighth length for the jogger. So that is what these are. Now, the reason I got these is because I love my stretch high rise pants. But what I found is because I sized up to an eight for the butt, obviously there's more fabric like in the front. And so sometimes I feel like it could look a little sloppy because it's like a little bit too big. Um, and then also I do notice sometimes that it bunches at the bottom because I got the full length. So um, again, I still love those, wear them all the time, but I just wanted to try the size six and the shorter version. So. You can obviously see it in the try on, but I'm not sure which I like better, to be totally honest. I'm going to keep both because I wear them so much, and I also figured, like, I could wear these ones on the weekends because it will be a little tighter, and I don't know. I just, I will find a use for them. I love these. I think they're so comfortable. So if you've not grabbed a pair of the Stretch High Rise Pant, I would recommend starting with the pant like if you had to decide between the pant or the jogger i think the pant is more versatile um and i would just do like black or navy but i love these i have them in so many colors and like i said i'm kind of just experimenting with like different styles to see what i prefer but you can't go wrong and i think you can wear them casually on the weekend you can wear them to work you can wear them to church you can wear them like i, I mean there's just you could even wear them to the gym you could even like lift in them if you wanted to so anyway they are super versatile i mostly wear mine to work um, but i love them and highly recommend okay so the next two bottoms i grabbed on we made too much so i will link the full price like regular version um and then if there are some on sale i always make sure to link those as well for you so if these current ones aren't available the like regular item will be um linked so this is the Align Short 8 inch, but this one was in the Yogo. So recently, Lululemon's been coming out with like lots of black pants that have like their name or their pattern, like a like some sort of like Lululemon affiliated pattern, right? So like I also in an upcoming haul, I bought the Wonder Trains that say like Lululemon on them. I think those are so fun. Um, I know I saw someone say like it reminds me of like it looks very like nerdy and I don't know because it's like all the letters, but I think it's really cute. This one is the Yogo. So this is what it looks like. I think this is really cute. And I have a pair of Wonder Trains that have like the Lululemon logo on it from um, a couple of years ago. I think I got it on like the Black Friday or Cyber, or not Cyber Monday. Um, what's it called? Boxing Day sale. Um, and I get so many compliments on those. So when I saw these, I was like, you know, I really like these. And it's like a fun alternative to just plain black, but like 
at a quick glance you can't tell but also if you want to wear an all black outfit it's kind of fun to have some sort of like pattern or something so I think they're really cool um, I think they're really fun and these are the 8 inch so I like the 8 inch or the 6 inch honestly if I'm wearing um, like a long top or sweatshirt like the all yours tee or the perfectly oversized crew then I like to wear the 8 inch because I like it to go a little bit longer and then if I'm wearing like a crop top like the all yours crop or like an Ebda Street crop or or, um, I don't know, those on the line high neck tank, um, that I like the six inch. So that is, um, what I got. I also got these in a size six. So I think these are cute and fun. And I mean, I think that like, it's worth it if you see, especially on sale, anytime a black like pair or item in like one of your, I guess, hold on. When one of your favorite items in black goes on sale regardless if it has a pattern or not i think you should pick it up because you usually don't get plaque on sale so the next thing that i got is the wonder train high-rise crop in the 23 inch this is in a size six in the color mineral blue now um the 23 kind of flares out around my ankle a little bit which you can see in the try on i prefer i think the 25 inch in the wonder train is really my favorite i also have some 21 inch which is good too um but i think i just like the full length 23 is fine. I have no problem with it. It just does flare a little. So I just want you to be aware of that. The only 23 legging that doesn't flare on me is the base pace um, 23 inch. And I think just because it doesn't have a seam, it's similar to the Fast and Free where it's just like a laser cut bottom. And so for whatever reason, it's just like, it's, it's like skin tight. It's like, it's similar to a line. It's made with Nulux. So Nulux is like the high intensity abrasion resistant, um, version of new Lou. so anyway the only 23 inch that i like that or not that i like but that like really hugs my ankle is the base face these ones flare a little so i just want you to be aware of that but i love the wonder trains they are um lululemon's fastest drying fabric they are so great for workouts i wear them for um f45 and crossfit all the time i think they're really great also this is such a random fact but if you do like crossfit or something um and you do like rope climbs i wore my base pace leggings which are made of new Lux, and the rope was too rough for the new Lux. um but i always wear wonder trains and i don't have a problem at all so if you do crossfit and you do rope climbs wonder trains all the way so i know that was a very specific comment but anyway um the Wonder Trains have a draw cord. They have just like the straight seam in the back. I'm sure so many of you have seen these, so not really much to get into, but I just love these. Really, really great. They're very practical. I wear them for workouts um, or casually as well, and because they're Lululemon's fastest drying fabric, whether you're sweating or you spill on yourself or whatever, they will dry really quick, which is super awesome. Okay, the next item that I want to share is a swimsuit, and I am just like still not 100% confident trying swimsuits on online. I don't know why. I props to all those girls who do like full-on bikini try-ons. I just like, I don't know. I'm not like totally comfortable, but I did do a, a little try-on for you. Um, so this is the raspberry cream one piece. This is the waterside v-neck skimpy one piece. I got this in a size eight. I really love this raspberry cream color so much so this is what it looks like in the front and then I didn't show the back because it is very um, like cheeky so here's how it like scoops in the back which is really cute and flattering but this is what the um, let me see how can I hold this up so you can see this is what the back looks like so it is very <laughs> I'm trying to show you it is very cheeky so um, I think it's cute though because like I feel like I've reviewed this once before I tried it in a black and I like the black but I also wanted a fun color I feel like sometimes as a mom I want a one-piece suit but I don't want it to look like unflattering I guess I, I still want to look like cute I still want to feel good in it so I like when it has like some of these cute features like a low back and like a cute little v-neck and then like uh, you know it's got like it's kind of a skimpy back but if you're really concerned just you could just wear shorts obviously so I just think this is really cute I really like this color the one thing I will say that I noticed is it's not like a hundred percent 
opaque not, I guess uh, that's not the right way to say it but like in your crotch um, you can kind of like it's not like a super thick fabric and it's a lighter color so you can like make out like the crevices <laughs> I don't know how else to say that but um, I'm a little nervous about what it's gonna look like wet to be 100% honest just because this color is lighter so I'll definitely just like kind of wear it around like our home like at the house um, around the pool at the house so I can like see what I think about it but I do really like it I do really like this bathing suit I would just be careful with the lighter colors because I'm not sure if they're a hundred percent like I don't know I it could be slightly sheer so just be aware of that so that is the bikini or the bathing suit and then I've got a couple tops for you so next this is one of my favorites this is the align high neck tank and this one's in strawberry milkshake which is just so pretty with the light and stuff it's looking a little bit um it's looking like white but there you go it's really just the prettiest little baby pink and i think it's so cute i really love the way the align the high neck align tank sit like i just think it's very flattering and then of course the back is like the regular scoop so i wear these in a size 10 um when i get the regular line tanks i like to size up to a 12 because i feel like it is um like it shows a lot of cleavage obviously that's not an issue with the um high neck version and i usually wear these casually i love to wear them with like groove pants i think looks really cute um line shorts i recently wore them with the inner glow shorts which was really cute and i am going to i decided i wanted to see if i liked them for workouts obviously it's made with nulu so it's not meant for like high intensity but i think you could definitely wear it like for lifting and stuff um so i'm gonna test it out for the gym just because i like if I'm going to invest in something, I want to be able to use it multiple ways and I want to be able to tell you whether or not I think you can use it in multiple ways. So for now, I wear it casually, um, but I'm going to test it out for the gym and I will report back. Okay, next top is another one of my favorites. This is the Ebb to Street Racerback Crop Tank Size 8 Wild Mint. So my true size is a size 10, but I think this one runs a little big. I always say like I have a little bit too much room in the like neckline if I get my true size 10. So I size down to an 8. Love these. Um, this has a built-in bra as well. The um, Align Tank also had a built-in shelf bra. So I like to wear these. Um, I just love this color. I think this color looks so cute with um, Charged Indigo. I think it's like a fun combo. So I wear those actually um casually or to the gym if i'm gonna do like a high intensity workout i like to layer some sort of bra underneath just because i like the extra compression but i've worn it i wore i have a white one that i wore all day at disneyland and it was so comfortable all day and then like i said sometimes i'll just layer a bra under it to do like i could go running in it um i can do f45 orange theory if i have an extra like extra support personally um if i'm just lifting or something then i don't need that but i think it's a very versatile top like i was saying um about the align tank i think that you can wear this so many ways and i think this color is so fun so um these types of tops are also really great if you're going on vacation like if you maybe you wear it the first day and you go out and you do whatever and then you decide to go to the gym the next day then you can also wear it to work out in so i just feel like i like bringing stuff like that when i'm on vacation so i don't have to bring like multiple items if i can wear something twice um for different purposes i think that's really great so just something to keep in mind for that one and then lastly um i do have another one of my favorites but um i don't know if i like this so much in white so anyway this is the swiftly tech high neck race um wait did I say that right swiftly tech high high neck tank in the race length um this one's also size eight I do size down in this one as well so I really like this top I think that the swiftly tech high neck is super flattering again I really like to wear these for any of my workouts any of my high intensity workouts I don't really wear them casually though you totally could because they're so lightweight these are also made with um an antimicrobial fabric so that they don't hold on to um like any bacteria so you can wear them multiple times without them stinking so again like if you wanted to like take them traveling or whatever you could the only thing is with this white and i'm going to show you up close 
um, I don't know. If, oh, there you go. So do you see how it like, um, just because the way that this, the shirt is made, it's got like lines almost. And that's, I mean, that's just the way that they make it. So that's, it's not like there's anything wrong with it. But when I wear white, I kind of like, like a stark white or like an ivory, obviously. But I just don't know if I, I haven't decided, um, if I'm going to keep it because I just don't know if I like it with the lines, which I know is kind of silly, but I just haven't decided. So those are my thoughts on this one. I really love this top. I think it's really great for any kind of workout, but I just, um, I kind of feel like sometimes when it has lines like this, it can make it look a little dingy, even though it's not. Um, it can kind of look like it's a little bit older than it is. I don't know if that makes any sense, but like from here you can't tell, but when I move it up close, um, I hope you can kind of see what I'm saying. Like, I just feel like it looks almost like worn a little bit. So I don't know. Let me know what you think down below because I'm not sure I haven't decided on that one yet. Um, I'm leaning towards returning it, but I also love that style. So anyway, those are the pieces that I recently picked up. Okay, so that is it for this Lululemon haul. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'd love to know down below what your favorite piece was. Um, I love the Edge Street crop tank. I love the high neck Align tank. I, I would say those two are probably my favorites, especially in the Strawberry Milkshake and the Wild Mint. I just love those colors. So I'd love to know down below what your favorite pieces were from this haul. And again, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. It really does help my channel. So thank you to all of you for doing that. And again, I hope you're enjoying Vlogmas. Thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. Vlogmas in July. Because like I said, I am dressed for winter, but it is July. So thank you so much and I will see you in the next video.